Welcome back to another 5-Minute Showcase with your host, Builder Bear. I'm Builder Bear. Hi! And your 5 minutes starts now. We are in Warp Force today, looking at a house by Tentakiller. Um, I don't know if he's a killer. I don't know if he has tentacles, but his name is Tentakiller, so we're going with it. Uh, and we're looking at like a French chateau, chateau kind of house. Uh, my favorite part of the exterior of this house, of the facade, is the use of the our iron tech or our iron texture um, doors with the snow texture and it's such a perfect thing to use in Minecraft because it can give amazing detail without like killing you with depth with like giant blocks sticking out or giant gouges taken out with steps as people would use in the past and I love that it's in our texture pack done by pick me it's the best texture pack out there be sure to download it we're gonna go inside this big front door Ugh, no we're not Ooh, wait this is a speed free build by the way I did not even know that. This thing was built with speed, um, probably in as much time as it takes me to build like a bathroom. That <laughs> I'm so slow, Tentakiller did this super fast. Let's whop, 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 give some love, look around, can't open the front door, break in the house. <sighs> All right, I'm in Silder Shaders, by the way, Silder Extreme with night vision on. Uh, so you go do that too to view. view all the houses. View them like me, be like me or be nothing. The first thing I like about this house is this, actually I like the chandelier because it's a combination of wood um, and Silders gives off such a nice like warm glow and the way that Tent has done the um, the wood with the, I don't know, just like the mix, how he's done the glass at like right angles, it's really contemporary looking but really, I don't know, it, it, it's warm. It's warm and it fits the house very well and it's kind of mirrored um, all around. I have a dining room over here, pretty normal. I like the chair designs because it's like there's cushions on it, and that's that's something you don't see a lot of. And actually, a um, little bit like how the cushion doesn't go all the way to the edge makes it look even more like a cushion to me, and that's really cool. The rug's really cool. You have the redstone line on the side to give it a little bit of variation, and then the coral blocks. I love those for texture um, carpet as well. Then over here is like a grand piano with a sitting area. All right, one thing I want you to look at through the house, we're like wasting a ton of time in the beginning. One thing I want you to look at throughout the house is his use of, um, a really cool little office too, his use of like cushions and blankets and blocks. I've never wanted to sit or lie down on um, a bunch of blocks more in my entire life than looking at any of his houses. And that is, talking to him, he's like, yeah, that's my favorite part too. Really nice sink design as well. You have like the washing basin and then like more of the normal sink part. That's not something you see every day in World of Cross either. And then he's very good at putting all of the appliances in a kitchen. You have like microwave down there, oven, and then like a little coffee station. We're gonna go down the hall and just kind of, there's a bathroom. Here's like a, ooh, it's a laundry room, a downstairs laundry room, and like a linen closet. And then over at this end, we see a bathroom and then our first bedroom and again look at that have you ever wanted to lie down in minecraft more than looking at this bed dude what, what do you mean dude what a perfect combination of like different depths and different materials and it just that looks like a bed that's piled high with stuff we just come on man and then like a beautiful fire with some built-ins on it you you went off on this thing you have curtain design with the pillar blocks it's what a warm and inviting looking place. Um, there's even like a little bench over here. Amazing design for a bedroom. And that is my favorite part by far of this house is the bedroom designs. Um, we'll, we'll kind of visit a few of them. I like this closet design, but again, the beds, the beds, the beds. Um, the best bed design I've ever seen, just by far. Um, I really like how you've used the, you've gone a little bit different direction. You've used the our uh, cha-cha um, trap doors as the closet doors. That's pretty dope, dude. It's actually like, you can see through them. And I don't know, it's like not something I would have ever thought to do, but it really just, it gives off a vibe, man. It doesn't take a whole lot from the room. It doesn't darken it up because it's kind of a closed off space. Um, so yeah, this, that's really it. This is the um, master. So overall, what I'm going to take from this build is use different um try to invoke as many different depths and different materials as you can don't just use blocks he's used banners he's used player heads all of these different things to kind of give off these feelings of a um of like of different you know pillows and blankets and whatnot and that's that's really just i don't know it's not something that you see a whole lot of being done 
but Tent has taken that and he's actually run with it. And there's another house I really want to showcase. It's a modern house by him. And I think he does it even better in that house. It just fits so much better. Um, so come on the server, take a look at this house, uh, ring-a-ding the bell. One second, I'm out of time. I'm Builder Bear. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.